My name is Manny Pandori, um, and I've been a, a, a network member for a number of years, as well as an ambassador for Lime. I first heard about uh, Lime Connect when um, they branched out into Canada and uh, had an event at York University where I was going to school there. Um, after that period, I had, uh, began to get involved to help out with some of the outreach programs that Lime was doing at the, the different uh, universities around um, the greater Toronto area. Um, and since then, I've been kind of an active member of the uh, of the overall network. So what I think differentiates Lime from other organizations is um, the way that the messaging and the positioning is of, of Lime. Um, some of the other or, uh, disability or organizations tend to be less geared towards professionals and for someone like myself where um, I was in business school and I kind of knew the direction that I wanted to take my career, um, it was nice to have a, um, a an organization that was much more geared towards that and um, geared towards professionals um, and uh, new graduates. And so I, I think that's what kind of separates Lime from, from the rest of the pack. Being a part of the Lime network also, I think, um, is great because you have an opportunity to meet so many different partners. Um, now with some of the uh, different partners that Lime's expanded into, you really have a cross-section of all of the major industries um, within Canada. I think it's a great opportunity for people with disabilities um, to, to really come in and, and meet with some of these great partners who are looking to, to kind of add people. You know, sometimes with a disability, you can um, it's, it can be a little bit daunting. You know, if you go into a situation where if you're going to a networking event that's run at your school or, you know, run by an industry or something like that, it can be a little bit daunting when you go into the room and there's so many other people there and, you know, you, you feel like you stand out. But I think the, what I would tell people about Lyme is that, you know, you're not alone in that there's, you know, a, such a large community of people who are here to help and who, um, you know, can uh, identify identify with you and so um, for me personally just you know being part of that network it really goes a long way because it, uh, it it makes you you know know that you're part of another group of people who are you know going through the same thing